cubes and cube roots properties of cube roots and estimation let's look at some general properties of cube numbers let us take a look at the cubes of numbers from 1 to 20 1 cube is 1 2 cube is 8 3 cube is 27 4 cube is 64 5 cube is 125 6 cube is 216 7 cube is 343 8 cube is 512 9 cube is 729 10 cube is 1000 11 cube is 1331 12 cube is 1728 13 cube is 2196 14 cube is 2744 15 cube is 3375 16 cube is 4096 17 cube is 4913 18 cube is 5832 19 cube is 6859 and 20 cube is 8000 Observe the ending digits of these numbers. Which digits do you see? What can we say about the cubes of even numbers? We can say that the cubes of even numbers are always even numbers. What about cubes of odd numbers? Cubes of odd numbers are always odd numbers. Observe the unit place of the cube. If the unit's place of the cube is 0, then unit's place of its cube root is 0. If the unit's place of the cube is 1, then unit's place of its cube root is 1. If the unit's place of the cube is 2, then unit's place of its cube root is 8. If the unit's place of the cube is 3, then the unit's place of the cube root is 7. If the unit's place of the cube is 4, then the unit's place of its cube root is 4. If unit's place of the cube is 5, then unit's place of its cube root is 5. If unit's place of the cube is 6, then unit's place of its cube root is 6. If the unit's place of the cube is 7, then unit's place of its cube root is 3. If the unit's place of the cube is 8, then unit's place of its cube root is 2. If the unit's place of the cube is 9, then the unit's place of its cube root is 9. Using the properties of cube and cube roots, we can try and find the cube root of a number. But note that this method will work only if the given number is a perfect cube. Let's do it through the following examples. Estimate the cube root of the following. 2,38,328 Form groups of three digits starting from the rightmost digit. The number is even, so the cube root is also even. 8 is in the unit's place of the cube, so the unit's digit of the cube root is 2. Therefore, the cube root of 2,38,328 is dash 2. Now consider the group of 238. The biggest cube number below 238 is 216, that is 6 cube. So, the tenth digit of the cube root is 6. Therefore, the cube root of the given number is 62. Estimate the cube root of the following. 4913. The number is odd, so cube root is also odd. Form groups of three digits starting from the rightmost digit. 3 is the unit's digit of the cube. So, the unit's digit of the cube root is 7. Therefore, the cube root of 4913 is equal to dash 7. Now consider the group of 4. The biggest cube number below 4 is 1, that is 1 cube. So, the tenth digit of the cube is 1. Therefore, the cube root of the given number is 17. The next number is minus 1,75,616. We know that cube root of a negative number is also negative. In this case, therefore, the cube root of minus 1,75,616 is equal to minus of the cube root of 1,75,616. 
Thus, we only have to find out the cube root of 1,75,616 and add a negative sign before it. The number is even, which implies that the cube root is also an even number. Form groups of three digits starting from the rightmost digit. 6 is the unit's digit of the cube. So what will be at the unit place of its cube root? So the unit's digit of the cube root is 6. Therefore, the cube root of minus 1,75,616 is equal to dash 6. Now consider the group of 175. The biggest cube number below 175 is 125, that is 5 cube. So the tens digit of the cube root is 5. Now the given cube is a negative number, so we add a negative sign before the cube root. Therefore, the required square root is minus 56. Did you understand properties of cube roots and estimation? Yes! If you like our videos, do share them and subscribe to our channel. If you want awesome quizzes, write to us. Keep watching and keep learning with Walnut.